probably this is maybe um so i'm just like uh i got a little bit of respite from this burning and whatever is burning and then it started right back up again and uh she's just really bad right now like just she doesn't stop You know, she doesn't she doesn't stop she's she's living some like some kind of fantasy in her head about um angels or demons or whatever the fuck i don't know it's like she's found a gateway to hell or a doorway to heaven or some bullshit i i don't know i think she's full of shit if you ask me because i don't know i uh, kevin says he hears just his name being called kevin 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 I'm hearing the entire sentence. <coughs> I'm having a conversation with this person. What the fuck they're doing trying to cover up? Are they blocking my... I don't know what they're doing. I have no idea. I attest to this one time. I was on a farm with my friend. I left my phone on a swing. And I walked off. He was sitting uh, near the swing. And I walked off. I walked around. Was, um, and uh, same thing she was talking to me now unless they were close by with some long range transmitter that I could hear how how was that happening two things either they were close by with some long range transmitter but then why is it that only I could hear her and not my friend I'm a human being he is a human being. He's a human being. If you blow a dog whistle, we can't hear it sometimes. Silent dog whistle. Every dog that's around should hear it. Not just one dog. It's not fine-tuned for one dog. It's for dogs in general. They'll hear some variation of the sound. Why wasn't my friend hearing it? don't know because I could still hear it it's either the, they had a transmitter but what is the receiver here is there something inside me did these fuckers put something in my mouth while I was sleeping or heaven forbid someplace I, I have no idea what the fuck are they trying to cover up what are these people up to? It's like, what are they trying to cover up? What did they do to me? What the hell did, did they do to me? I, I don't understand this. Why would they do anything? I mean, it's like, are they just, were they just using like massive, massive, massive amounts of drugs? Alcohol, what were they doing? Did they just lost control of themselves completely but for how long these the the, the 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 cop was talking about the what they call them bind benders benders these benders they go on benders benders something they go on something you know it's like they just go off and they drink for days or they drug for days or whatever it's been two fucking years there's many many alcoholics out there millions millions of drug users how many of them would mess with a woman like this without any intent i call bullshit pure and simple primo top shelf fucking bullshit they can't blame this on drugs why me i was not the only person in the yard i was not the only woman in the yard why me of all the things that they would do on these binders or binders or whatever they call them, this is what they would do. Fuck me up? Why? Without any intention? Prior intention? I call bullshit. Big time primo bullshit. I just had a, like, I'm just, you know, I'm tired of it. So I, I went to put some food in the microwave and in my in my kitchen this it's just like I want to double over with this fucking microwaving the pain is bad even when at, I unplug the microwave 
my air fryer is on. The only thing that's in there that's plugged in is the fucking fridge. Everything else is unplugged. Where is it coming from? Everything else is unplugged in there. It's like I want to bend over with it, with, with, with pain. This especially around your refrigerators, this happens. I don't know what she does to it. I don't know. Is she fucking with the electricals, like twisting the, 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 the neutral and the, um, the polarities? I don't know what they do. These fuckers, they just really don't have anything else to do but to fuck with people. I mean, okay, let's say her she misses her boyfriend. Now, I never spoke to the man. I don't know him. You know, when you miss someone and that person isn't there, isn't present, what's the next best thing when you need to feel close to the person? You go look for somebody who will remind you of them. Some friend or somebody. You, do, you, do, you need some connection to that person. It's called life. I understand that. Been there, done that. Long time ago. I'd never met the fucking man. So I don't, I don't, I, I seen him. I saw him. But I've never actually had the displeasure of speaking with him. Now she's saying I, I called him. Well, I called him a pervert. In my own home, I'm allowed to speak and say whatever I want. My opinions, it's just like a certain body part. Everybody has one. That didn't give them the right to hack me. That didn't give them the right to chase me halfway across the... I need this to go to court. I am sick and tired of this fucking... This woman just saying these things to me. Just because she has this technology that she can do this, doesn't give her the right to do so. Because let's, let's break this down a little bit more. Let's just say, well, she's always like, well, I said this, I said that. Yes, in my own home. In my own goddamn home. It's not like I took out a billboard somewhere. In my own goddamn home. If it was that annoying to them, why the fuck didn't they say something when I was their neighbor? I didn't know all of this here until I moved out. Up to then, I thought it was just a prank that went too far. I had no idea that this was going to happen or this is, you know, I don't know what this is. But my, my, my thing is, she's always saying, well, I said this or I said something in my own home. Okay. I had feedback from other neighbors that they saw crap too. Obviously, they said things in their own home too, but they're not going to go fuck with them. Because they're more than one. They know who they pick on. They know who they pick on. Alright? They know who they pick on. The second thing is that they had they were talking about me too. I'm sure they talked a lot of trash about me in their home. Well, nobody had the, the displeasure of hearing that. But nobody can say, well, you said this and you said that. I really don't know. I don't know what they said. But they had to have at least had, a, uh, they had to confer at least once before all of this for two, for over for over two years. I mean, what do you think? There had to have been some um, um, dialogue, planning, execution. There had to have been something, even if it was five to 10 minutes that resulted in two year, two over two years of torture for me. They had to confer at least once for five minutes. What do you think? Unfortunately, I didn't hear what they said, so I can't accuse them of they said this, whatever ugly names they might have called me, but they heard everything I said in my home. It's like, life is a gas, isn't it? Oh shit, I shouldn't say that because it's, they will, she will take that now as, as an, you know, it's like she, yes. It's almost like she gets excited. It's almost like she gets excited. And I'm really tired. Because it was just, yeah, like, I'm just, like, she wants to know heaven and hell. Angels and demons, whatever, whatever this about. 
she needs to come in this house and in one minute i will show her the gate to hell and the road to heaven i promise i'll show it to her it'll take me about a minute it's too much it's just it's too much pain it's been over two years no rest i don't know what this is about this doesn't sound normal does it even if you have a a vengeance against me for something I don't know. You hate me for whatever reason. This is what you'll do? I don't understand it. Why this? Why these methods? Why this modality? I just don't understand it. Why choose these particular brand or methods of torture? I, I just don't get it. Why? What are you trying to prove here? I mean, what the fuck is this? Is one of them in jail and is they're being microwaved and, and fucked with 24 hours a day so she she's like trying to get revenge? He didn't fuck with me. I didn't put him in jail or her in jail. So why the fuck would you do that? Why didn't she start with the, with the person in the mirror? And abuse the shit out of that person. If she wants to, you know, abuse someone in revenge for what's happening to her. I don't know. Person? I don't know. I want to say male or female. I, I really don't know. I, I'm, I come at a loss at what to say. I feel tired. I can smell the, the thing burning again. And I just... It's just all this microwaving. But I'll say something. Is that try, try to stay... Uh, peaceful and calm. Replace these negative words with positive ones until they start to make sense. Until your your mind can come up with a lot of adjectives and memories of what these words mean. Words like love and peace and harmony. And flow and balance. And equality. And justice. Until your mind only knows these words and the meanings. And what of your experiences were, are, and what you want it to be.